Alrighty guys and welcome back to more Disguise 2 and Adele is very uh, creepily right behind Taro which is hilarious. So what we're gonna do is go ahead and progress the game here. I wonder if you could eat frogs. <laughs> is that devious look? Don't look at me with those eyes. Now Hanako, if you eat something like that, you'll get a stomach ache. Oh, <laughs> Seems fun. Yeah, we already talked to you about all that. Let's talk to this guy. They said on TV that there's this super overlord that's stronger than an overlord. He must be really strong. You're always showing off, but can you beat a super overlord? A super overlord, huh? Seems tough. But if I get the chance to fight him, I'll beat him fairly. I'll never run away. <laughs> One day I just look like this. I don't know what's going on. But it's a matter of how you take it. Now I can fly. You're optimistic. My family is like that too. But why is it that you're such a carefree demon? Did you know you can attack while lifting a friend? Yeah, there are many other techniques to apply with lift and throw. Try different things in front of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, here we go. There, I got the felony. Now, I can go to the next map, right? I see you have a criminal history now. <laughs> now you may go to tragedy land. But be careful. A normal demon would not set up such a complicated trick. It might be even a demon, or it might even be a demon lord trick. Well, good luck and don't lose your lives. Demon Lord? Could it be Demon Lord Etna? Probably. Probably. Tragedy land. I'll show you a tragedy. Whoa! Huh. Killing all these stupid things was just a waste of time. Is Overlord Xenon even on this worthless mud ball? No one's even seen the bastard. He must be hiding, dude. <laughs> You know what? Now that, I, news. now that I think about it, I don't. I've never heard Edna's voice until now. <laughs> she really talks like this, huh? And we saw Overlord Zenon's daughter. He must be here, dude. Oh, so those printings we saw earlier was things are making sense now. Then why didn't you catch her? Don't tell me a spoiled little princess beat you up. Is that Michelle Ruff? Could be Michelle Ruff. I don't know. <laughs> we'll catch you next time, dude. We bought these provocative photos of her from a talking frog. <laughs> they weren't cheap. Wow. We can pass them around to help find her, dude. Bruh. Jake, you are a shrewd businessman. It is some kind of trick, princess. Their cunning trap to sabotage our perfect chemistry, huh? You mustn't be fooled. <laughs> <laughs> you idiot. That's her? Isn't it a little convenient that she's with the first group of people to pass us by? It's great! We found her, and we get to keep all the photos! <laughs> hey, those are... Aren't they the lackeys of some demon lord who wants to oppose Xenon or something? Are they truly demon lord Etnas? This is convenient. I shall rid you all at once. Perhaps you should not, princess. Oh, I cannot bear to see you turned into a frog as well. Oh, so they're the ones that turned you into a frog. But if I defeat Etna, I may be able to return you to your human form. Listen, you. Which one of you is Demon Lord Etna? Show yourself at once. The only one that isn't a pretty, so obviously. I am Rosalind, the only daughter of Overlord Xenon. I challenge you to a duel. Hey, what are you doing? How is losing a duel gonna help me find Xenon? Damn! That boy drowned in the poison. Oh, so you're Overlord Xenon's little girl. I guess you really do exist. Women and children should stand back. Now, where is this demon lord, Etna? Um, hello? Demon Lord Etna, but you can call me Beauty Queen Etna. Sapphire, look, lies! You do not look anything like the one who turned me into an idiot frog. What? what? Demon Lord Etna was not the one who attacked my father's palace and changed Tink into an ugly frog? Hmm. Hey, 
I thought you said Demon Lord Etna did all that stuff. What's wrong with you? Well, you see, someone powerful did this to me. It wasn't Overlord Xenon, so it had to be Etna. Or so I thought. You thought. <laughs> you were wrong all along, and now you're mad at us? Your red personality really bites. But there is some truth to what Tink said. How can we be certain that she is Demon Lord Etna? She just said it. It is difficult to imagine that a demon lord would have such a flat chest. How does that have to do with anything? She's cracking her knuckles now. <laughs> Why would you say that? Why would you do that? Why would you punch a pretty? <laughs> that pretty looking flat extra chest, serious. Huh? Looking extra scared. Sweating bullets. Ah, you are a demon lord! I am your loyal servant, master. Please, I am yours to command. Damn, that was a quick surrender. Don't you have any pride? I proved I'm who I say I am. But what about you? Are you really Xenon's daughter? Check out this four leaf clover. Yes, I am. I am Overlord Xenon's only daughter. Great! Can you take me home to daddy? Like right now? Why? Why? So I can kill him and make myself the new overlord, silly! But top top, I don't have all day. Or I could amuse myself by killing you all. One at a time. You can try. Brought us out here! Oh, damn it! It was me! <laughs> Bruh, he exploded. I I won't help you! I, Rosalind, will not be coerced! Rosalind was just talking so tough. Oh, are you trying to protect Daddy? You are so adorable! But if you won't help me, then I'll just have to kill you first! I won't do it! I won't be bullied by a flat chested fornicatress like you! Fornicatress? The other friend about to get up and ah, again. You really wanna die, huh? She's powering up! Oh god! Ooh, deflected, my boy! You. You're very determined. I don't really like demons or girls, but I respect that you're risking your life to protect your family. What's your problem? Why'd you get in the way? Because I promised her that I would return her to her father. So, I can't let you kill her. I must protect her. What is this nonsense? She was attacking me. Why didn't you run? I made you a promise. I'm gonna keep that promise even if it kills me. You... you are that devoted to your silly ideals? You were actually going to keep your promise to me? Overlord Xenon's daughter? What? You don't believe me? Son of a... Fool! You are going to get yourself killed! You may not care if you die or not, but won't Taro and Hanako be sad if you do? Don't worry. I won't die. I still have other promises to keep. I still have to defeat Overlord Xenon! I don't understand. Everything you say and do is contradictory. You don't need to understand it. All you gotta know is this is just my style. But do you have grace, my dude? about to catch them hands in a second. Alright, here we go. Actually, I think we can just hit her with... She actually might just be throwing, um... Ooh, yeah. She actually might just toss... Ooh, what the fuck? <laughs> She's actually like 10,000... Uh, at level 1,000. What the hell? This has got to be a scripted fight. 
Elder Spear, Falcon Shoes. Oh no! Oh shit. Dude, if I could, that would have been lovely. Yeah, it doesn't go too far. Dude, it looks like I can still like her weapons. Look at that. She got some really good shit. Pretty sure they don't expect you to beat her. A level a thousand? Something's gotta happen during this fight. Something's happening. Alright. I'm thinking she might throw printies at us. Alright, there's a lot of chests here. These these printies are just there. Come on, fam. I tell you what, Derek, what we're gonna do. I have a feeling that she's just gonna poke us if we go this far. One, two, three. I'm actually gonna have. Hey, 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 hey! So we're gonna toss Lanier over here. Here we go. I ain't got time for these prints to be tossed at me. You know what I'm saying? So Adele, CC, you're gonna actually CC. Hmm. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. All right. So you know what? Tink, on the other hand, can probably get tossed. No, Tink can't throw, so I would probably want somebody else that could. She has a move of four. He has a throw of five, so one, two, three, four. Yeah, obviously he's not going to be able to toss people right there. So four, and then one, two, three, four. Alright, so we should be able to toss her right here. And then she can just come over here. Douche, 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 douche. Douche. Get them out of here. I don't want her throwing printies at us. <laughs> I think that's her thing, right? Throwing printies? She's Louise. CC. Alright, cool. So, what we're gonna do now, we're actually gonna have. This actually seems like a crazy strat, but I'm actually gonna have... Yeah, he's gonna have to take one for the team. The reason why I say that is because I don't think I have two more humans. Yeah, I need two more humans for this to actually work. I'm actually gonna throw her... Yeah... Rosalind... You're gonna throw CC over there. This actually might work. It might not. I don't know. Actually, CC, you wanna do this. Rosalind, you wanna do this. You're gonna do this. There. CC. Alright. And boom. I'm actually gonna go ahead and do this. Do health. It might work, it might not. Damn, it doesn't. So now, I, I can't... The only way to save her is to do this. So I can do Lisa, this man. So I can do this. So basically, I'm just gonna get her out of there. He's gonna have to take one for the team. <laughs> so there we go. I tried to poison her, but you know she's a boss. I don't know what they're what they wanted me to do here, especially against that level a thousand. Taking on the chest, man. This shit is scripted. This shit is just is, is well beyond scripted at this point. Ready, dude. 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 
Alright, I'm gonna throw this pretty at her. Yeah, this has to be a losing fight. I'm sorry. Alright, let's go ahead and lift your boy over there. Let's just... <laughs> Our goal might be, might be to lose as fast as possible right now. Let's lose as fast as possible. Base battle destroyed. There you go. <laughs> All right. I'll, I should have put everybody back though. Ah, oh, fucked up. See, now it's still gonna be slow. Cause, oh no. Okay, I fucked up. Whatever. It's fine. Just end our turn. End the turn. Fuck me up, Edna. Fuck me up. These printies, though. Asteroid drop. Oh, God. Uh, oh, God damn. And then she moved. <laughs> That's broke as fuck. Yo, is it possible to uh, maybe steal something from her? Wouldn't that be crazy? Don't defend. So we're gonna see if I can possibly steal something from her. That'd be crazy. A 1% chance. Better than none. If that would have worked. <laughs> Yeah, we're not gonna have a chance at doing anything here. Get out of here. Give me an extra chance to maybe steal something here. And Dill actually has a lot of health, so Edna's gonna be the one that's gonna have to kill it. I actually wanna try to steal. I want to try to steal like something from your girl. Ooh, she said no dice, fam. Well, we gotta die, fam. We gotta die. Uh, I should just let them blow me up. Uh, I guess she wasn't gonna catch them hands. Plot, plot convenience saved her ass. Plot convenience saved her ass this time. Oh, I wonder what was in the chest here. This printer should come down and kill me, yup. Pretty dude! There's nothing we can do, dude. What power? This is the strength of a demon lord? Oh, no, 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 no. That wasn't even a warm up. That was just to show you how strong and beautiful I am. Mandatory loss. I don't like though. I very much don't like losing. <laughs> so, princess, ready to take me to daddy? Wait. You sound like you've already won. Isn't it a little early for that? Uh, 
fight's just getting started. I haven't even played my trump card. Why do boys always feel the need to show off in front of girls? Now, I was kind enough to let you laugh. Don't tell me you enjoy this. I always keep my promises. Whatever it takes, I will take you back to your father. Why? I am Overlord Zenon's daughter. I am your enemy. Why are you trying so hard? Quit being a tryhard. I hate lies in any form. You hot blooded punks are always such a pain. Maybe I should just put him out of his misery. No, wait! I'll make this easy. Just tell me where Overlord Xenon is. But... If that's how you want it, this is your last chance. I can't tell you. Wow, you're a cold-hearted bitch. <laughs> Sorry, boy toy. You heard the princess. I don't care. I choose to fight. All my life. I've always had my own style. Touchy. Now you get to die in your own style too. <laughs> wow. Wait, I really can't tell you. Cause I don't know. Sure you can. You just don't want to. No, you, you don't understand. The reason I cannot tell you is. I I don't know where my father is. I have never even met him before! Wah, wah, wah. It's six o'clock and time for the news! Oh boy! Let's start today with an update. The hell Since is the confirmation of Overlord Zenon's whereabouts, the backwater world of Veldheim is the latest travel hotspot! It's a camera! We're keeping a close eye on Veldheim as this story develops. Will Xenon finally be revealed after a million years? Will someone finally bring Xenon's reign of terror to an end? Demon and overlords around the universe are seeking the challenge. Whoa, somebody turned it off. What the hell was that? I sacrificed my own health to give them that information, and they didn't even mention my name? What about my glorious comeback? I started this whole craze. I made this Veldime rush possible. Why didn't I get any credit? <laughs> the network execs canned us out of everything. They don't even have our money. I called them, but they all act as if they don't know anything about us. <laughs> no. Have they abandoned me on this hellhole? Me, Axel, the dark hero? This dude gets no love. <sighs> they have abandoned us. <laughs> Unless the network sends a crew to pick us up, there's no way we can return. No, the gig's not over yet. I'm Axel, the dark hero. There's no situation I can't rock out of. <laughs> Axel, darling. I've got a reason to go back and a home to get back to. Save the file, I guess. Let's make a new one. Oh, damn it! How could I lose to that girl? Just be glad that you weren't hurt that badly. We should thank that demon lord for allowing you to return at all. I'm pathetic. I can't even keep a single promise. I'm all talk. If only I was stronger. But hasn't it been like a really long time since you've lost a fight to anyone? That demon lord must be really strong. Don't worry, brother. I'll get him back for you next time. She's sort of right. It isn't like you to be depressed. Just get stronger and beat her next time. But damn. Adele, just be happy that you're back home with your family. I know you're mad because you lost. I also know that you're fighting so hard for us, your family. 
But for us, what matters most is that you come home alive. That is what we hope for the most. I'd be mad too if I lost. Please, make me a promise that no matter what, you will come home alive. What's with the change all of a sudden? You're usually screaming at me to hurry up and defeat Xenon, but now... Adele? Okay, I promise. I will come home alive. What's wrong, princess? You haven't said a word. Does it hurt somewhere? Still looks like a cow. No, that is not what disturbs me. Princess, that's amazing! You healed faster than everyone else! The Axel Scheme, Episode 4. I guess we gotta get ready for more Axel. If you didn't like Axel before, you're not gonna like him now. Father? Father? Is that you? What is wrong, Father? What happened? Father, please answer me! It was all a dream? It was all a dream. No, a nightmare. Or a glimpse of things to come. Alright. So what we're gonna do here, we lost our first battle, unfortunately. We're gonna go ahead and save our game. We're gonna have to hold that salt, just like Adele's gonna have to hold that salt. And uh, the next time we come back, I'll probably have a little bit more knowledge on certain mechanics, and I'll probably have a little bit stronger crew. But in the meantime, I'll see you guys next week for more Disgaea 2.